Today, I'll be talking about the online retailer, Amazon.com. Amazon.com is an online shopping website that you can buy things from like toys, books, electronics, music, and a lot more. Today, I'm going to be answering the question, How has Amazon affected the world in positive and negative ways? I think since Amazon has affected small businesses in a good and bad way, and that Amazon has also tried to attract more customers to Amazon and Amazon Prime, I've come to a conclusion that Amazon has really tried to improve their website over the years. People have been mad at Amazon for their Prime membership two-day shipping guarantee being late, only to find Amazon saying the customers misunderstood it. But that might also mean regular Amazon packages can arrive at the same amount of time as Prime packages. People are sometimes outraged by the two-day shipping guarantee arriving late. Amazon claims to have helped small businesses, but is that always really true? Possibly and possibly not. People are saying that Amazon has brought down a lot of small businesses. So which is true? From my research, 68% of all small business owners say that Amazon has positively affected their sales. However, you could probably guess what the other 32% of them think. Yep, they think Amazon has had a negative effect on their sales. Small businesses might try and compete with Amazon, but some might not get far. Amazon has different ways of attracting customers to them. If small businesses want to go up against this computer giant, then they might really have a challenge going on. Amazon says they have lent over $1 billion, but small business owners still say that Amazon has had a negative effect on them. Amazon also said that they have helped create over 900,000 jobs worldwide, but people still aren't budging. So how else has Amazon affected the world? Amazon has always been trying to attract more and more people to their website. For example, Amazon has even went up to giving free shipping to attract people. They have even resorted to letting people sell things on their website. People could be getting into online shopping more and more as Amazon continues to attract even more customers. Lots of small businesses are falling behind and they will have to differentiate their own shops or there will not be many successful small businesses left. If you think positive, you can find that people can get good birthday gifts and toys and anything useful or fun that they want. But what about late shipping again? A gift a customer is going to give to someone arrived late. So there are a few positives, like that people can get nice things Amazon has to offer. But Amazon is only good in some ways, and the rest could affect some people negatively. In my research, Amazon has sold a lot of things in its history, and a lot of people are happy about what they can buy on this tech giant. So Amazon is also pretty positive for their customers. I use Amazon myself too, and I think it's really awesome. But just because I think that doesn't mean it's awesome for everyone. Amazon has brought some people downhill, and not just businesses. The fuming Prime customers and Amazon also raising prices too. Amazon might have to make slightly better choices so that more people can enjoy it and it won't hurt people as much. Overall, I think Amazon has affected the world in a few positive ways, but I realize that Amazon can be a negative thing to people like small business owners or angry Prime customers. Amazon could have been specific with their Prime membership or helped a bit more small businesses, but for now, Amazon might have to develop a little more and earn more positive effects on the world. Even though I think Amazon has affected the world more negatively than positively, I asked my interview what he thought and he changed some of my thoughts. Now, for a brief explanation of how my thoughts were dramatically changed by my interview. My interview said he thought Amazon has affected the world in a great way because he liked not having to spend the entire day driving to different stores and Amazon was easy and fast. Now I feel that Amazon may not be fast for shipping, 
but it does save a lot of time. My interview also changed some of my thoughts about shipping. My interview told me that Amazon is well known for its low prices, fast selection, and fast shipping. He also said that Amazon creates an easy way for small businesses to sell to customers. Amazon is always continuing to grow more and more, and my interview said that Amazon definitely has no means of slowing down. So now what do I think? Correct. I've changed my mind. I now think that Amazon is a really good thing that happened to the world. Even to find that the way Amazon formed was by a nap in sketch. Surprising, isn't it? To think this giant success was formed by the very Mark Dunn This is actually This was the origin of Amazon, drawn on a napkin. I hope you learned a lot about Amazon.com in my video. For more information, visit my blog. Thanks for watching!